on the seventh day of Christmas, my manic made for me. Death night arisen. <laughs> A brand new thing. Element of Earth, three fresh pigs, dead zerg bugs, and a quick bit of Saints Row 3. Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Manic the Nobody, and I will be your Worgen Death Knight for today. And, uh, apparently World of Warcraft has revamped character customization, so, uh, we'll take a look at that. Still not anywhere near as good as character creation in games like Star Wars The Old Republic, uh, Guild Wars 2 or Lord of the Rings Online, just to name a few, but, uh, but not bad, per se. Let's have a look at the face here, uh, can, like this, this you can change the color of his face, like this, uh, hairstyle, the hairstyle on your worgen, uh, on the worgen cell still affects the human. Which is a bit annoying, to be honest. But, eh, I guess I can get over it. And there's so few options for hair color. It's, like, it's not great. Definitely not the best, nowhere near. But, it's okay, I guess. And like it has be or as has become a staple with me, I have no plan at all when it comes to the name, so randomize button. Dudo. I like it, and that's how we pronounce it. Dudo. And I will enter the world as Dudo. The Worgen Death Knight. I'll do whatever comes up the opening of the first quest. I've never played Death Knight before, this is my first time. I haven't played World of Warcraft for that long, as you may or may not know. And I have no idea what the song was for today. A hero. I haven't recorded it That's yet, but I'll stop talking now. Were. You stood boldly against the shadow and purchased another dawn for the world with your life. But the evil you fought is not so easily banished. The victory you claimed not so easily held. For now, the specter of death looms above the world yet again, and it has found new champions to bring about its final reign. Knights of darkness, wielding runes of death and destruction, bound by the will of the Lich King. This is the hour of their ascension. This is the hour of your dark rebirth. Oh, hey, look. Valkyries. Uh, let's skip all this. I will not be using Zygerides. Uh, Dudon. I work for the Lich King. Life. All oh, that I am. Anger, cruelty, vengeance. I bestow upon you, my chosen knight. I have granted you immortality so that you may herald in a new dark age for the Scourge. Gaze now upon the lands below us, the Scarlet Crusade scurries to undo my work. What light hope stands defiantly against us? A blemish upon these plague lands. They must all be shown the price of their defiance. You will become my force of retribution. Where you tread, doom will follow. Go now and claim your destiny, Death Knight. Quest objective. Report to Instructor Razavarius. Resuvius in the heart of Arcurus. Alright, uh. And I I'll, like, uh. Vengeance I bestow upon you, my chosen knight. I'll. I have granted you will you shut up, Lich King? So that you may in the I just read all of that. Shut up. Stop it. Stop it. Thank you. No, stop. Stop. Stop right now. Anyway, I'm gonna read what I've got here. Auto attack, uh, death grip, harness the unholy energy, charm, mind on icy touch, chills the target. You have heard the call of the Lich King. <clears throat> Hold on, let me try that again. Shut up, Lich King! You have heard the call of the Lich King, Death Knight. 
Now is time to answer your master. Right, uh, the single most important piece of equipment to a death knight is the ruin blade. It is through the rune blade that a death knight commands the powers of frost, blood, and the unholy. The rune blade also acts as a vessel to store the death knight's runic power. The time has come to create your first rune blade. Search the weapon racks on this floor and locate a battle worn sword. Once found, take the sword to a nearby rune forge and use it to create a rune blade. Quest objectives search the weapons rack and even hold for a battle worn sword and then use it on a rune forge to create a rune blade sword. Return the rune blade sword to instructor Razver uh, Razuvius and Ebon Hold. No, I will not join your guild, dang it. No, I will not join any guilds. You guys can't hear me, uh, people who are sending me guild invite size. But eh, who really cares? Two forms. I love being Warren. I've actually never played Wargan before either, because I don't technically have Cataclysm, I'm just on a ten day trial. Oh man, do I have to talk to the Lich King? Oh wait a second. That's Zyger Guides. I wanna shut that off. Uh but I'm not entirely sure how, so I'll leave it be. Uh I'm to search the weapons racks on this level. Uh, weapons racks. You there. You. Take me to the weapons racks. That's not a weapons rack. That's an abomination. I remember playing Warcraft 3. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It was probably my first real time strategy game. No, no. My first world time, the real time strategy game was uh, was Warcraft. Or not Warcraft, Starcraft. I played Brood War, and then played Warcraft two, one, two, and three. Played them in order. Uh, I have no idea where he said that the uh, the Munich Forge thing was. Let's talk to him again. You need and you may hear my uh, my roommates in the background. They're kind of loud. Rune Blade is an extension of your being, and Death Knight cannot do battle with we'll that. Have our revenge. Now let's have a look at my map. Uh, I want to see my quests. Let's have a look at my quest. Uh, take the sword to a nearby ruin forge. I don't know where a ruin forge is. I assume that this is a ruin forge? Could you be a ruin forge? Yeah, you're a rune forge, and what do you want me to do? Uh, use it, I guess. Yeah, drive the one cups of blade. Forges the battle worn sword into a rune blade sword must be used near a ruin forge. I now have a rune blade sword, emblazoned with frost, blood, and what was that last thing? Unholy what? The room blade is an extension of your being, and Death Knight cannot battle without it. Uh, well done, Dudo. You have successfully created your first room blade weapon. With it, you will sow the seeds of chaos and destruction. If your wake will be a bloodied field of battle, littered with corpse oh, in your wake, littered with corpses of all that would dare oppose the scourge. I get a room soul blade and the room forging skill. Lovely. I'll see if I can level once within this within this video. Uh, decline. I decline any of that. Uh, rune forging allows the death knight. Isn't it? Rune forging. Preparation for battle. The mark of war is etched <laughs> indelibly upon your soul, death knight. You have learned the dark art of rune forging, and with it you will engrave runes of power upon your weaponry. Preparation for battle must be made. Return to one of the rune forges here in the heart of our <laughs> and use the power of rune forging to emblazon your weapon with a rune of power. Return to me when your blade glows with dark energy. Quest objectives and structure. Stop walking away from me. I'm, I'm reading. Make it quick. Quest objectives. Instructor Razuvius in Ebon Hold has commanded you to use your rune forging ability to engrave a rune of your choosing upon your rune soul blade. You may freely replace the engraving upon your weapon at any time, so long as you are near a rune forge. 
And I can spec, apparently, a uh, Blood Frost or Unholy. Yeah. Death Strike, Heart Strike, Runic Strike, Empiric Blood, Rune Trap, Dancing Rune, Weapon, uh, Frost Strike, Howling Blast, Obliterate, Pillar Frost, or Unholy. Nah, I prefer being a tank more than I prefer being damaged. Yes, I'm sure I want to learn this spec. Shut up, Zyger guys. I just want to stop you. Let's use the rune forging. Rune of Cinder Glacier. Uh, fix your rune with the rune. Uh, fix your rune weapon with a rune that has a chance to increase the damage by 20% for your next two attacks that deal frost or shadow damage. Modifying your rune weapon requires a rune forge and you hold. Fix your weapon with a rune that causes 2% extra weapon damage as frost damage and increases enemies. I, know, I like that. I'll engrave it with that. Engraving. Engraving. Now return to instructor Ziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziziz
you will receive 825 experience. Funk to funky, we no major on the junkie. I I don't think that's the tune, but eh, who cares about the tune? Nah, I'm kidding. Everyone cares about the tune. It's a David Bowie song, but you know, ashes to ashes. Funk to funky. We know Major Tom's junkie strung out in heaven's high, hitting an all time Bow high. To your master. I would read this, but I know that he's going to read it, just in case though. The time to spill the time to spill <clears throat> the time to spill the blood of our enemies approaches. You must first learn what it is that you seek to destroy before rushing headlong into battle. It is what separates a death knight from a mindless ghoul. I will grant you sight beyond sight, my champion. You will use the eye of Acris to steal our enemy's secrets. Complete quest, and uh, I'll accept that quest later. See you guys later.